Hey guys, and welcome back to Project Zero. When we last left off, the game was certainly starting to get quite a little bit harder. Uh, I think the kid gloves us are off. Let's just say that much. Anyway, um, we did fight a ghost, and we got thoroughly kicked. I believe that ghost is called Long Arms. Uh, we also found a door in this room that is sealed. And we know it's sealed, but there's nothing we can really do about it. We also discovered the main reason of the control difficulty, or at least my control difficulty. And that basically is that the game decides to change the controls when, ooh, when you get into combat. This, ooh. Uh, on the night of the 3rd, the police received a report that four children failed to return home after 9pm. There is an old superstition in the surrounding village about children being snatched away by ghosts. Some villagers indeed suspect that this is what happened to the four kids. Yeah, okay. Is there anything down here though? No. Alright. Interesting. So, let's have a little squiz around. Right, so that's where we came down. Uh, the door we need to get to is around this corner. Doesn't look like we have any ghost action going on right now, which is good. Those ghosts can stay the hell away. Now, um, I do have the key on my phone. Right, there are buttons with characters. This device must open the door. There's engravings underneath. No, that's YouTube Studio. That's not what we want. Uh, gallery. There we go. Uh, there's engravings underneath, but it's gouged. Can only read some. We can just barely make out. The Shinto ritual strangling and held on the day of from the gouged out words. So, that's 13. So, I guess each one has a s special meaning. I'll figure the rest out. So, I think zero. Yeah, zero is at the top. And it goes counterclockwise right so by my powers of deduction that will be zero three will be so zero one two three uh, and then we need 12 if my phone would stop going to sleep that would be great uh, right so, I'll figure out the rest later. So, we need obviously one again and 12. Hey, there we go. I might actually print that out. I did try and get a photo of that off Google that I could easily print, but apparently, no one in the world has actually ever thought of that, which I find very hard to believe. Oh, God. Girl pointing. It's her again. Okay. Did we get anything for that? Photos. Yeah, we did. Okay. Uh, we don't have a lot of XP because we spent it all. Which, you know, that's, I guess, what we... Oh, Spirit Stone. Yeah, it's really weird. There isn't anything in the drawers or chests. So... It is worth searching. The corner of the room is an old suit of armor. Because not everything shines. There doesn't seem to be anything in the drawers of the chest. I feel a powerful presence in the back of the room. Yeah, well. We know that's where the ghost is sealed. There's something at the back of the shelf, herbal medicine. Fuck yeah, we'll take that. Uh, right, there doesn't appear to be anything else here. But there is stuff up here, I guess. Ah, oh, coffee. Coffee, the lifeblood. Research scrap. Can hear movement. That's weird. The disaster called the Calamity. Long ago, great tragedy struck this region. One legend calls this event the Calamity, but reveals no detail regarding the disaster which unfolded. 
A brief description of the event is as follows. The mirrors kept in the five shrines broke and the dead returned from hell. I wonder what sort of disaster it must have been because the passage can't be literal. Hmm. Another spirit stone. We're getting a lot of these spirit stones. Which is cool. Uh. Oh, hello. Old diary scrap. I don't know if I got this before. May 20th. We've finally gotten through uh, the move to Himura Mansion. I've had a hard time cutting through all the red tape with the local officials. But just as I'd hoped, the air is fresh here. This should be good for ya ya ye ya yo yo in her poor health. My daughter, uh, M Mikoto, seems to like this area too. She's made friends here already and is enjoying herself. Yai seems to think this old mansion is spooky, but I plan to do some work on it. Make it easier for her to live in once I get settled in my research. The best thing about living here is that I don't have to go out to do all my research. It's all right here in this mansion. I could be right by Yi's side. I will look up the pronunciation of that. Uh, all time. Okay. Right. In oh, fuck. <laughs> As you maybe jump then. Son of a bitch. Right, cool. Uh, yeah, not sure I actually got that last time. All right, well, let's go back downstairs. Um, is it me, or does she have weirdly long legs? Like, legs her are 80% of her height. Uh, maybe 60% of her height. It's just something, something about her character model just looks really off. But that might just be me. All right, so. Boom. Seductress. Oh, she doesn't look very seductive to me. The ghostly sense has disappeared. Okay, cool. I think that should open the door now. Alright, well we're making progress. Progress is good. Now, where was... No, that's... So we need to turn around. Yeah, that quick turn doesn't work. Um when we don't have the camera up as well which is really frustrating i wish we could quick turn when whilst we was out and about but you know i guess we can't have everything i suppose part of the difficulty of these games is the forced difficulty right let's go save the game because if we can we're gonna save i'm gonna save this game a lot just because um if i do that I might have a small chance of actually making it through. I say that. Whilst we have all of these uh, healing items as well. We've only used one healing item, which admittedly, like, we're on the first night, man. I'm not sure that we should really have used a healing item already, but hey. That's the way it goes. All right. So, I know I fought a ghost in here before as well. Look at those shadows on the candles. It's actually really good for the PlayStation 2. Very good. Alright. No more talisman. The force that was holding the door shut is gone. Yes. Good. Then use the door and go through it. Ooh. We have blood. Blood. Oh, God. You know what I'm going to do, guys? Because we just saved the game. I'm going to get that ghost. Because we need all the XP we can get. So, one second. Right, let's try that again, shall we? Once more, we're feeling. I... Jesus, they're hard to get. Last try. Got her that time. Got her, I hope. Did we actually get any points for that, though? That's the question. 
Yeah, we got 439 for that, which I would say that's worth it. Now, we've got another door there that's got a talisman on it. Okay. Mm -hmm. the other, uh, some other place shows in the photo. Yeah, I can't really make out what that is. That's cool, game. That's cool. Right, okay, well, oh, hello. Uh, I have no idea, what are you trying to say? What's this? There are several pieces of paper on the floor. Looks like part of a notebook, black notebook. September 13th, 3 p.m. Uh, Tomo's condition is getting worse and worse. She can't stop shaking and she keeps mumbling the same words over and over. I don't know what's happening. Is anything s uh, if what's happening is anything supernatural or not. But in any case, I think we better leave as soon as possible. Uh, Tomo is in such bad shape, she can't even move. I guess I'll have to look for a way out of here myself. Even if we waited for help, I doubt anyone would ever come looking for us. Yeah. I'm guessing there's nothing actually here. Yeah, it's just resonating off the uh, wall there. Ooh, so we've got another locked door as well. Okay. <clears throat> Where's that? Oh, some other place shows in the photo. Is... Is that the other save room upstairs that we were in earlier? Maybe. Well, I guess we're going to find out one way or another. All right, we've got a nice gravel path here with some goodies. What, what goodies have we got? There's an audio tape, red tape. Now we know the red tapes are uh, tomatoes. So let's listen to tomatoes red tape. September 11th, 8.16 p.m. We looked all over the mansion, but we still couldn't find Koji. While true that this mansion is huge, I'm certain we would have found him by now. Could we have already left? He's been saying something about more rope since we took some photos yesterday. Hmm, I've been talking about ropes. I always love these games, you know, where you pick up um, a red tape. The door is closed fast. Where, yeah. Um, so you pick up, like, this massive red tape. Uh, you know, what was the tape? 90 minutes per side. Uh, oh. Woman in atrium. Hmm, I don't think anyone's going to be saving you today. I just, I've got to make sure that we actually get our points for these. Yeah, 279. Wow, some of these really aren't worth much. Uh, yeah, you always pick up these big red tapes, um, which were like 90 minutes aside, something like that. And they've only got like a couple of seconds... Of dialogue on them. It's really strange. Such so wasteful, man. <laughs> so wasteful. Oh, I like this area. I mean, what is with that skirt? Oh, hello. What's the point in a skirt like that? Another tape. Was that tomato? Hmm. 
<laughs> That's actually really savage. So this ghost is actually bounding them. Oh. Kitty. He knows her. Audio tape. Okay. So, um, this ghost is actually tying people up in this strangulation uh, <laughs> with all these ropes and murdering people. Uh, that's actually really interesting. September 12th, 9 a.m. I found Koji. His death was just like one in the mountain village. His head and limbs were severed. Bloody hell. Yeah, that's pretty crazy. Oh. Uh, the garden lantern in the photo is lit. Okay, I put the photo in my file, but it's not lit here. I'm guessing we need to light it. Uh, oh. Oh. A woman pulled in. Ah, there we go. Alright. So that's opened up. Uh, another one of those doors, which is cool. Alright. And we've got some goodies over here too. Sweet. Something reflecting the light. Stone mirror. Beautiful stone... Polished to a mirror-like finish, it possesses strange power. Uh, tell me more. Uh, item. I should probably read up what all these items actually do. Uh, stone mirror. A polished mirror-like stone. It protect A protective spirit dwells inside. Right. I guess that's a good thing. All right, cool. Cool. Right. Mm -hmm. Yeah, uh, I think I've got a lot more health than I had before. I'm pretty sure... Yeah, I think we have to light that um, lantern as well, I think. Ah. Box of film on the ground. Type 37. Not bad. How many shots of Type 37 do we have now? It's got to be a bit... F and only 48. Wow. Okay, so you don't get a lot for your money at all by the looks of things. Right, let's go back. So we've opened another room up. But before we go diving into that room, let's go back and save it. Because things are progressing. We are, you know, we're winning. Slowly. I haven't encountered any ghosts for a while either, which... Well, I mean, I guess that's possibly a good thing. Although, I don't know. Ooh. Something's crying. No more talisman. Ah, oh, shit. Is... Oh, God. Oh, come on. There we go. Woman turning. There we go. Right. Did we get the shot? This actually is not the room that I want to go into. Photo. We got like 500 for that. Yeah, smell you later, love. Uh, I want to go back to the save room. Pretty sure, like, there's a boss or some shit coming up soon. I think. Because we've already fought um, Ortega. Uh, I think that was Ortega that we've already killed. Or should I say he trapped his soul. Um, right. I should probably look up and find out what these items do as well. We know that the herbal medicine is a healing item. And we know that the... Um, the spirit water is like a full hill. But I don't know what the protection mirror does. 
Uh, do I remember it from last time? I know some of these items actually respawn. I vaguely remember that from last time because uh, I was reading some information and some tips saying about some of these protective items. And they say don't worry about using some of them because each chapter some of them res respawn. But I can't remember what. Maybe I need to do some research. Okay. Uh, oh. I remember this room. Another spirit stone. We've got loads of those now. Kitty. Kiri. A doll with long hair and a white kimono. It's roped off with sacred ropes worshipped. Okay. Several pieces of paper. So, tomatoes... Uh, notebook again september 12th 1 45 p.m my sixth sense telling me uh some children are playing here i can't see them but they keep calling to me are they playing tag or hide and seek maybe they might be the children in that photo uh there were human heads in that room so many of them they were cut off by the Homuro family master they were all trying to tell me something i never should have come here i should have trusted that sixth sense of mine yeah Yeesh. So what else have we got in here? Uh, the tatami matting has been removed. There's a big hole in the floor. Okay. Oh. Somewhere in here we can use the filament. Ah. Where? There, apparently. Boom! Smile for the camera. Child on the Oof. Right, that's the other door opened up. Nice. Uh oh. Well, this doesn't bode well. Uh. This is... Oh, shit. This is bad. Oh, fuck. What is that thing? Oh, shit. That thing stays invisible. Charge. That did some good damage. Right, now we've done... Right, shot once. Where the fuck is it? There it is. Okay. Stick and move, motherfucker. Yeah, let's play. Come on, you little bitch. I ain't afraid of no ghosts. Ooh. Uh oh. Run. Okay, this one's not too bad. I remember having some difficulties with this one before. Gotcha. You little bastard. Get in the camera. Okay, that one wasn't too bad. That one wasn't too bad, guys. Holy shit. Seven ghosts driven away. Oof. Right, we've got 825. So, we could increase the max charge value. Uh, I don't know about that, to be honest. I like the idea of saving up for some of these more expensive ones. We are rapidly using our film up, though. Which... Kind of isn't great, but that's the way it is. Okay. We're getting a lot of spirit stones as well. Right, I'm going to go back and save it. I get the feeling that I want to go back and save it after every bloody ghost, which is probably going to start taking up a lot of time. But, you know, as I said before, if that's the only way that I can make progress... Because I get the feeling these are the sort of games that you need to uh, play, you know, quite a bit. To kind of learn the ghost patterns and stuff like that. I mean, I'm sure it's a case of that. I really am, you know. Um, and it, this, this isn't like, you know, Dark Souls or anything. But... 
The aged controls really don't help. And I don't think I saved it very often either. And for some reason I kept getting lost. Which is interesting because I'm finding the layout fairly easy um, so far. And you guys have been watching me for a long time. You know how bad I am. Oh. Oh. Hello. Oh. Oh, take that, you bitch. Oh. Oh. Oh, 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 oh. 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 Right. Come to. F Ooh. Stuck in the corner. Oh, come to mummy. Come to mummy, you little bitch. That's what we're talking about. Oh. Suck it down. Get out of here. Oof. That was pretty intense. Also, I did notice something down here. Ooh, that got the old adrenaline going. Bloody hell. Okay. She did... Uh, I remember that one, the broken neck ghost. Wow, we're getting so many spirit stones. That one did so much damage to me last time. Holy hell. I can't believe that. Uh, what are we on? Oh, we're almost out of time. I guess we could go through here now. See what is through here. Oh. Man turning. What do you have for me? I'm kind of getting a little bit of confidence. Oh, 265. That was kind of pointless, really. Alright. So Kitty is the rope maiden. Right. A lighter. There's a little bit of oil left inside. Ah, it's Takamine's lighter. Okay. There are several pieces of paper. Right, so this is um yeah. Takamine or Junsei's notebook. September 14th, 10 a.m. That woman, that uh, tomato called Kiri, looks just like the descriptions of the rope shrine made in the legends. And there's a strong resemblance, too. Hmm. Uh, between the way Tomato and Ortega died and the manner of the deaths in the folklore. So that woman is the rope shrine maiden, is she? Yeah, I guess so. Okay, so what's the significance of... Oh! Woman at the corner. So what's the significance of that then? 200, I mean, sure. It is what it is, I suppose. Hmm. Oh. Several pieces of paper look like part of a notebook. The mirror is breaking. Smash! A broken mirror. People on the floor. All over the mansion. So many people. All those people. What are they running from? And then, at the end, with such desperate looks on their faces, something's coming this way from deep within the mansion. A coldness. It's colder than anything I've ever felt. I don't know anymore if this is a dream or real. Ooh. Okay. Right. Where are we? Oh, right. So that's nailed shut. Ah. Ah, right. Hang on. So is that down here? Is this a shortcut back up to a save room? Because if it is, that would be rather lovely. And these mirrors are everywhere. A mirror like the one in the entrance. Maybe these mirrors in the mansion mean something. Yeah, maybe. Maybe. Maybe Miku. Is that her name? Yeah, Miku. Oh. Something else there. Oh, wait. Hang on. That's like around. Got ya. We need to be on our toes here. Because you never know. You never know when something's going to jump out. And say, surprise, motherfucker. 
There's an old book of rice paper on the grounds. It's written in charcoal ink. Uh, the legend of the holy mirrors. The mirrors of the five gods. The holy mirrors held in five shrines in this region are most commonly known as the mirrors of the five gods. The legend tells us that the five gods, before leaving this land, created these mirrors as a means of protecting the village. Some legends mention another mirror that... Uh, the story is all is that all five mirrors were used together in a ritual to fend off a huge disaster. Whether this was the calamity or not is not known. Uh, it's not known whether the ritual mentioned above is related uh, in any way to the one performed by the Homero family. But there is a correlation of the mirrors. However, the actual existence of the legendary holy mirror, uh, one complete mirror, has not been confirmed. And it's not known what the legend is based on okay yeah so mirrors ropes chains ghosts oh my some weird voodoo's going on what else have we got here small piece of paper on the ground the girl who has been found after three days of mysterious disappearance has been adopted mr Hines hanasaki a close friend of Mr. Ryuzo. Ah. Ryuzo, also missing. We'll adopt the girl. Uh, the girl's parents were missing, even after she returned. So the police was looking for a foster home or adoptive family. The girl does not remember anything from her disappearance. And the three other children are still missing. Okay. It's a small door here, but it's nailed shut and I can't open it. God damn it, really? Yeah, okay. Well, that's a kick in the dick. I was hoping that was going to be some kind of uh, shortcut. Right, well. Uh, yeah, because that leads back to the other save room. Does that mean we're going to have to go all the way down to the uh, save room that we've just been in? God damn it, game. Seriously. Unless we get uh, a tool later on. That we can open nailed shut doors with, perhaps. Uh, maybe, I guess. Stranger things have certainly happened, but I suppose we're going to have to go back to this other save room. I mean, you know, the save rooms aren't far apart or anything like that, which is nice. Uh, but it would have been a little bit nicer to have that one open. Now, I don't know if there's any penalties or anything like that for uh, frequent saving or whether you get bonuses for game completion time. Um, I don't give a shit because this is my first time through the game. So we're just going to take it slow. Right. So let's drop a save there. And with that, guys, I'm going to end it. Thank you very much for watching. And as always, till next time.